I have an amazing amount of disaster holiday stories to tell. Let's start when I was 10 years old. I'll tell you that one. When my mom is the kind of mom who wrapped with creases and a bow, like perfect wrapping. I'm a 10 year old hack. I knew what was in this box. It was Rock'em Sock'em Robots. I wanted to play with them really bad. She was at work, so I unwrapped it neatly and I played with them all day and I put them back together, which was really bad because everything was wrinkled and messed up at that point. And my mom come home and she noticed that there was this really up looking <laughs> present under the tree that did not look like all the other presents, how neatly wrapped they were. And I got in a lot of trouble for that, but the biggest part of the story was um, my sister came home and was giving me a bunch of crap about it. And me and my sister butted heads. She's three years older than me. I went downstairs. This was all Christmas morning, by the way. And she was great at sculpting wax figures and castles and all that. And she had ordered all these blocks of wax and melted down. And she made this amazing castle with drawbridge doors and windows, etched brick and whatever. And I sat there with the Aquanet hairspray and a lighter. And I really, I melted it all. But it was really more about the art to it. It was so cool watching it melt. I was so intrigued by it. And she lit me up, man. When I came upstairs, it was like a kick to the groin and then dropped me down and she had my head on the floor and she's banging it off the floor and I would look back and I was telling her I'm going to kill her every time I lifted my head up. And so finally she literally kept one knee in my back, took off into the bathroom, locked the door with this little latch we had. And I was kicking the door so hard to get in there that I didn't realize the door was cracking. So um, since I couldn't get in, I went back and I got the Aquanet. Aquanet, right? That's so funny. And a Bic lighter and I was thinking in my 10 year old mind, cartoons, if you heat up these metal old handles with the skeleton key thing, that it'll turn glowing red and she'll let it go. And so I'm blow torching the handle thinking I'm gonna get a nice red glowing <laughs> and she'll, but this is obviously in the cartoons and it doesn't work in real life. And I lit the whole door on fire and split it up the middle from kicking it. And my mom, like, she came downstairs, this is, and she just, it was a bad scene. So my sister ended up crawling out the bathroom window into the driveway and took off down the road because she knew I was coming through that door one way or the other. And that was just one of the typical Christmas mornings we had. <laughs>